Well, well, well. If it isn't who I think it is, two months down the line, am I really serious with this channel, guys? It has to be a punishment. Cut off her boob or something. No, guys. Welcome back to another episode of Reacting Series. You guys really love this series, so I had to bring it back. Now, today we're talking about the craziest things people have done for money. And I said I could just do this norm this video normally, but <laughs> someone suggested something on my TikTok. They said, why don't you do a YouTube video Zaza, you know, a little bit stoned. So <laughs> I've got the tea and let me get the other tea. <laughs> Give me a minute. Let me go get blazed. <sighs> what? <laughs> what? It's already down here. Assalamu alaikum. Alaikum salam. Let's get right into the craziest things people have done for money. I've read a couple and let me see. I'm not racist personally. They seem white. I, I don't think a black person would do this. I don't know. Tell me in the comments. Before we even get into this video, guys, look, I saw a snake the other day and I'm not even lying. I'm not lying. This is, this is the most dangerous I've ever felt in my life. And I'm not talking about, you know, a baby snake. I'm talking about a mamba. I've ever seen a baby snake and I posted on my story some time back. But you know, this was a snake. And I was walking the trail and I stopped and I saw a big long snake. And I was like, oh, at first, but then I realized it's dead. It was a dead snake. And it was huge. And I felt so, expl I felt so advent, I felt so, what's the word? Dangerous, I could say. Very, very out of my comfort zone. You know, something masculine I experienced. A dark masculine energy and <laughs> I, I don't know. I think about it from time to time. But anyway, let's get right into this video. Now, I wrote them down. Imagine, I wish I paid this much attention to my studies. <laughs> Let me chuckle to my D's that I've been getting. Don't tell anybody. A kid at my school was... <laughs> a kid at my school ate a blood tampon for $20. $20. He had to get tested for STDs because no one knew who the tampon was for. <laughs> no, I think every day I've seen something crazy or I've had something crazy. And every day someone proves me wrong. Blood tampon is crazy. Evie. Ice pop. Ice pop. For $20, just say you wanted to do it. Just say you're nasty. Just say it. Don't go through the corners telling people to pay you. You know you could have done it for free. You know you're a gremlin. You know you're a dog. You don't know. You know, you know what you're doing. And you're at school. Like, you, you'll be reminded every single day of how you ate it. Until you're in high school, daily reminder how you ate a tampon, bro. This is just the beginning. I ate a used band-aid. Just a crystal. For $22. $22. A used band-aid is crazy. Oh my god. I should have just done this thing sober. You guys are irritating me. You're delaying my anger. It was could have come with a hot slap. I could have been faster in rejecting you. What the fuck is wrong with you? A band-aid has every type of jam. I, it has like crust. It has blurred. It's got maybe some antibacterial that he had tried. It has the juices, the salts, the spice. <laughs> you are nasty and I know you're white. I'm sorry. <sighs> I used to phone call with a 70 year old guy and I would degrade him and tell him ways to torture himself. And I made myself an $800 check. That is actually impressive that's great i don't know i'm not judging because imagine all you have to do is act it's acting you guys you know pe i realize people take things so seriously you know just chill take a chill pill relax just act you know <laughs> we are going down here it's not good on our side <laughs> just pretend you know be hard you need to take, you know, a little wine before. 
do what you need to do by the time you pick your violet davis by the time you're on the phone i'm gonna start rating these um money hustling these hustlers <laughs> my hustler i'm gonna start rating their the levels at which they went for the money they were given let's keep going but you guys you know when i found out that actually people don't wash their ass i was like be so for real people don't wash their bum people you know the people who don't wash their bum <laughs> everyone's been washed your bum didn't you continue washing your bum be so for real be so for real so like you just have accumulated crust and accumulated shay god's beads hey, wash your butt if you're watching if you're watching this video and you have not washed your butt i don't know what to say my sister would pay me 10 cents a minute to be her personal foot rest and she watched while well, she watched tv that's just tradition that's what you gotta go through as a, as a sibling i don't know and you are being paid the people who are doing it for free <laughs> don't shoot the messenger shoot the message i was at a party where a girl sucked a fart out of another girl's butt for cigarette cigarette No more. Like, are you no more? Are you no more? Like, what's this? What's this? Cigarette, tobacco leaves. Tobacco. Tobacco. Your. Hey, just say you wanted to. Just say you're. A, just say you're a gremlin. Don't you know, guys? If you, if some of you are wolves, there's no need to pretend that you know. If you're a white walker, you're a night walker, and that's what you represent. That's your structure. That's you. Imagine sucking another fart. Well, guys, I have such a, I have such a gag reflex. Like I can puke on command. Start, don't start, don't start thinking. Delete, 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 delete. Crazy enough to do it at a party for a cigarette, cigarette. As if you guys, if it was like eight hundred dollars. Okay, actually, this this one is a bit on the high climax. You said we're going to read them. I'll take it. Come on, a thousand, a thousand dollars is something I would do for that. Um, I would do it. I don't know about you. That's fair. That's fair. For a cigarette, you've not even gone to fifty dollars. Nothing. Nothing. You're just a pathetic person. You just want in replace. You want lung cancer so that you can. You need your own category in corn, if you know. Ah! I let medical researchers inject me with salt water, so he could record how much pain I was in. <laughs> <laughs> i think some people don't love it here <laughs> they don't love it around this app you know <laughs> medical researchers inject you in salt water twice just to see how much pain you're in what records need this what research needs you to be in pain to get results what who does <laughs> and twice, like the first time you're like damn maybe it wasn't painful enough like let me go <laughs> help again I ate bags, any bag they wanted for the right price. Oh, wow. <laughs> bags, guys, bags. I can't. That's my last straw. Like, bags, it's just the place I can't go. When I open that door, you know, in the section of my brain or in the section of reality where I just open the drawer for bags, I couldn't record Zangwapo. Yani, I couldn't correlation, I couldn't mapenzi apo. Like, to, you know, I don't get it, they don't get me, and I'm great with that, and I keep it at that. So telling me that you want to digest. Glory, glory. Sprinkle, sprinkle. Imagine eating a pre-mantis. Just think about it all. You just sit there for the right price. And is this person black? Is this person black? The juices, the, the, the crunch, the exoskeleton. <laughs> juices, spice. <laughs> the gooey, like... If I bite into a bag and that goosh just goes through, like if I was on fear factor, you know what I mean? And I had to, I was there with my babe. Now, okay, guys, now let me give you the picture. Now that we are Zaza, I have to give you the picture. I'm there on fear factor with my boo. He has arms bigger than LeBron. Big, 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 big. Like he's so tall and big. And I'm just there, you know, we're both fit. Thank you. And like, you know, we've done all the obstacles. We've jumped out of helicopters. We've, we've you know, now it's time to eat the bag. If I bite into that bag, because I'm not a quitter, I gotta try it. 
I'm scared, but I gotta conquer. You gotta. <laughs> I am a soldier. Ah! I am a soldier in the army. So, I, if I bite into that bug and I just feel the gushy gush, the, you know, the juice is. Um, wrap it up. Wrap it up. Wrap it up. Wrap it up. I stole weed from my plug and then I added basil. <laughs> is it basil or basil? Basil. Bas the, the spice. Basil or basil tell me in the comments i stole weed from my plug and added basil and sold it to white kids in my school hey snowfall <laughs> oh my days you know i don't think that's even bad because i think basil is smokable i'll find that out let me confirm you let me know i'm not <laughs> that guy was in his bag and you know but you know like white guys they'll just trust you they'll just be like yeah i be, you look like you can sell legit stuff and it has oregano spice <laughs> Ubeka oregano, coriander, basil, salt. Da kafunga na glue, you know. <laughs> and you'll be like, bro, that was so legit. Like, what you gave me. I digress. I used to sell my morning urine. Oh, <laughs> for how much, bro? If you used to sell your morning urine, I feel like morning urine. Hey, morning urine. I feel like morning urine must be so conk. <laughs> It must be so spicy, like it must be so mineral filled. It's just like morning pee. I don't know. It's like you're dehydrated the whole night. And then people would buy that and sip. <gasps> people would buy morning urine. Like mo specifically, once you piss in that goddamn morning, give me that cup. You go and drink it and you pay money. Just drink yours, Amma. <laughs> why are you, Amma? You want someone else's? Oh my God! And these are the people you are kissing. I want you to know. <laughs> as you go to bed, as you sleep tonight, always remember: this is somebody possibly who has drunk morning urine, who has kissed your lips. <laughs> Seribasi is the answer. And I'm telling you, and the people, who, the, the the girls that get it, get it, and the girls that don't, continue the morning urine. Tell us about it. <laughs> Tell us about it. Huh. I tried robbing a homeless guy in his jacket and I got pricked by a needle. Don't worry, I'm okay. Like, <laughs> how down bad are you to steal from a homeless guy? <laughs> why would you steal why would you steal from a homeless guy? The guy is really homeless. Like you're making it. I sold my panties to my ex-husband because he said his current wife doesn't smell as good as mine. Oh sorry. <laughs> I love this channel. Ah, pick up a like. <laughs> Only exclusive, exclusive, exclusive info. Intelligence. <laughs> Not even if you waterboarded. Water on me. Not even if you took me to Russia and um, you put rats. You know that torture where they put rats in a bucket and then they put the bucket on you. Then they eat into you. I would, you would never get this information from me. You cannot. Watch any fair. Like in kazi, kama hi sita But you know what, guys? I never, I never participate in these. What can I say? Kuchi was my. Oh my god, my kuchi is better than Suju's kuchi. I'm just like, oh my god, kuchi is kuchi. Situations like this, it makes me feel like is kuchi really kuchi? <laughs> because current wife is crying. <laughs> oh, darling, and she has to. But you know, she's smart. I, she would, she could be doing it for free, but she's putting a price, and I respect that. You see, you need respect, nampua. Because babu. She's able to get some money just by doing the bare minimum, and I love that. I, that's that's. In fact, you're approved for the loan. The loan that you're thinking about, I've talked to the bank. Looks like you're starting that business, baby. I was paid one fifty dollars to be tasered by two men. <laughs> I would do it. I would do it. How many voters? How many voters? They are called votes. The voltage. <laughs> Put it in me. I'm a strong tower. 150 guys. That's 15. G oh, that's little. I'm not gonna lie. It's a bit little. Maybe 500. I was saying maybe 500. Tears me then. Shock me. What have I not seen? <laughs> I'm here reading this. I sent a pooping video to a 70 year old and he wanted to hear the poop sound. Oh my days. I think you guys, the fetishes, they're. It's now giving me cognitive dysfunction. <laughs> I can't even begin to accept that there are some 
fetishes 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 i can't accept it's just my brain is like mm, 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 denied denied i it's just it's not normal to me i don't know what it is i have some dissonance right now i'm experiencing the grace i'm this i'm digressing from you right now i'm suffering now because i'm neurodivergent and now i have to think about it all the time i'm not normal people don't know that guys thank you so much for watching this video it's been great please make sure to leave a like subscribe thank you i had my testicles aspirated needles and fluids in and out of my testicles for a male contraception study and had my stomach feeling like paste looking back it wasn't worth the a hundred dollars it left my left testicle numb <laughs> hey are you normal <laughs> 10 g's guys a hundred dollars your testicles are given injections for a hundred dollars needles in and out fluids in and out and now you have a numb testicle a hundred dollars <laughs>